Yessa. Left at nap time. Wanted to make sure she'd sleep on the ride. earlier we made it to the front but now we're at our campsite we have a couple campsites which is awesome so we have plenty of space we have this little beach like all to ourselves over here this was the last campsite so we've got the water right in front of us and it goes all the way to there Charlotte and my dad are already down there with Rondo playing anyways we're setting up site right now we've got our kitchen over here set up our tents over there not yet we're gonna wait till cool down set up our tents but we're gonna get things set up and i'll check back in heading on over finally got the tent up got my swimsuit on i need to take a dip it is hot i am so red oh my god looks awful <laughs> night didn't really close the vlog we just kind of hung out um made s'mores played some games after charlotte fell asleep and stuff like that but today we've got some more friends coming to join camping right now per usual my dad and charlotte are down at the beach with rondo throwing the stick around for him wherever he is there he is yeah so we already had breakfast we make bag omelets which are really cool. I'll show those tomorrow morning. I totally forgot this morning, but super easy, fun camping hack. Ziploc bags, put your eggs and everything in it and then just boil it. So we'll make those again tomorrow. So I'll show it then. Um, but otherwise, I'm hopefully gonna remember to keep vlogging. Are bag omelets. You start with a Ziploc bag. You want the quart size. You um, don't, freezer. yeah, so you gotta use the freezer ones because you want them to be extra thick because you're gonna end up putting it into boiling water. So you start with the bag. You can put however many eggs you want inside. I'm just gonna make an omelet for Charlotte, so I'm just gonna put one egg in. Um, so you start with your eggs, just a regular egg. I'm going to crack it into the bag. As I get all the shells in. So I've got the egg in. 
and you can add whatever you want inside. Um, you can add leftovers of anything that you've made camping. You can add green chilies. We have butter to add in, onions, obviously cheese, but you can add anything you wanted. I'm just gonna do cheese and butter for Charlotte. Some cheese. That's probably about enough. Put some cheese on the top after. Some pieces of butter. A little bit of salt. Green in that. And a little bit of pepper. Zip it up and leave a little bit of air in there because you want to be able to mix it all around. Not too much air, but just a little. And then you'll just kind of smush everything together to mix up your omelet. So we've got a pot of boiling water right here. We're gonna lay this inside and just hang in the little edge over the side so that it doesn't worry about catching on fire. It's hanging off just a little bit out the side so that when it's boiling in there, you're all good. So you probably want about four or five minutes per egg. So we just put this one in. You can set a timer or just kind of keep track, um, take a look at it and stuff like that. Once it's done, you'll notice obviously it's not runny anymore. So you can pull it out, kind of maybe squeeze the middle. If it's still all runny, you can put it in for a little bit longer. So while it's cooking, you can always kind of like take a peek at it or flip it over if it needs to be cooked more on the other side. So I'm gonna take a look right now. Mommy. So the egg's all finished up here. We're gonna put it on a no, plate. No, no, no. Okay. Okay, let's see. Let's see what the judge says. Who's that? Who's this right here? Hello. Is your eggs yummy? Mm. I would call that a successful breakfast. 